Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of the new save file. We are going to jump in for another run and I think this time we're going to play as the Sheriff. We did an episode as the Sheriff on our Let's Look At sort of series. But I think this time I'm going to give a go at just adding this character to our roster of characters for the series. Because this character does have some unlocks um, and some of you guys said that you'd like to see this character be part of the regular series. Someone made a really good point actually that this character's kind of like... Um, having a mix of um, starting with Neptunus and um, and is it uh, Proptosis? So it's like the closer you are to enemies, the more damage you do, and then you've got this sort of charge up idea. So it's kind of is it is very vanilla esque, and I think that's kind of why like when I played this character yesterday, that I felt like felt kind of that way that there was some familiarity, and it felt like it sort of fit into Isaac. Obviously, there's the fact that it's a gun, but um, overall. It, it is kind of familiar. I can't believe I didn't get hit there. I really like it. For those of you that didn't see the episode that showcased his character, by the way, obviously this is the sheriff. We start with a gun. And then quick draw allows us to, like, quick fire all of our shots, but very inaccurately. And uh, basically, whenever we stop firing, we, um, we then uh, sort of recharge our shots over time. It's kind of interesting. We'll see what item we've got here. Oh. You couldn't ask for something better with this character. And this character does synergize, so as you can see here, all of those uh, different types of tiers are giving us special effects, so very happy with that. I'm very much not happy with, uh, with this as a room. Oh, yeah, this is a really, really horrible room. I, I, like, how am I meant to... I'm sure I'll use a bomb. <laughs> I'm going to take too much damage if I try and actually do that room the way that it's intended to be done. Because that is... Ew. <laughs> I already took one damage. I'm not taking more. Oh, I've got to remember that these guys shoot. Because I keep forgetting that. Okay, nice. Okay, lovely. Push the button. But yeah, I'm really happy that we got a, a status effects item right off the rip. I mean, Plato Cookie's an item that I absolutely love anyways. Um, but still, it's, it's just great. It's just great. Oh, some explosive tears there from Firemind. As for the question of the day to day, um, what's a really interesting useless fact you know? Just something that, like, you don't need to know. Doesn't really make any difference to your life. But it's just real interesting. Or, you, or at least you think it's real interesting. Other people might not, but you do. That's all that matters. Yeah. Let's be careful here. Oh my god. Okay, slowing down is good. Took some damage there, wouldn't like to, but Whirling Leech is a good substitute here. We'll keep going down. We'll just try and go a regular path here and get some unlocks done. I think this character's got six unlocks. I don't, don't think there's a tainted version of the character yet, but there could potentially be one day, so we'll keep our eye out. Yeah, I'm liking that we get to see all these different status effects working. Like I said, they are just basically... A different resprite of tears. We also saw last time as well that if we get mini Isaacs, it, it's hilarious. It just gives us mini Isaacs with a goddamn gun. All right, let's try and let's try and actually utilize this guy. There you go. Lovely. I'll try and get this as well. Eh, not quite. Come on, my boy. Help us out here. Hey, there you go. Nice. Okay, feeling a lot better about this run after that two soul heart drop. That's really, really nice. 
But yeah, I want to try and play a few more modded characters. I think, um, just based on what I've seen from, like, the views recently, I think people might be getting a little bit bored of some of the vanilla characters we've been playing recently. So, we'll spice it up with some modded characters for a little while again. We'll, we'll, uh, we'll come back to the, the modded characters, playing them for a little bit, and then we can, uh, we can make our way back around to the, um... Oh, God. Ooh, damn, we had, like, a, um, brain worm shot there. Um, we'll make our way back around to the vanilla characters. We're actually getting really close to finishing a lot of the vanilla characters, so it's not even a big deal about, like, not getting unlocked or anything. Uh, I'll, I'll crack that open. See what we get. Hey, double bomb back is, uh, very, very nice. Lovely. I'm trying to think of what tier effect I'd want next. I, I really want to see what um, what rubber cement would look like with this. I think rubber cement would be a lot of fun. Also, yeah, I need some fire rate increases. I think that'd go a long way with this character. My God, I do I do really like obviously the the fire rate of quick draw though. That's nice, but the the base fire rate seems very slow. Right, let's go find our item room real quick. I want to see getting, getting some, like, modded items that work with this character. Like, see what, like, Pride Pin looks like. Things like that. I bet there's some really interesting modded uh, item interactions here. Obviously, there's also custom coded synergies as well, which will be good. Hey, beautiful. Another soul heart. Lovely stuff. Stop putting out spiders. It's not what we need. Oh my god, there's so many of them. Stop. Ooh, ooh, Lucky Song could be interesting. But yeah, I'm sort of back onto the idea of, like, random facts. I, I, I always love um, just finding out re really weird shit. I mean... I used to watch, um, when, when he used to do, uh, the Binding of Isaac, I used to watch Northern Lion pretty religiously. Um, I've probably seen a few thousand of his episodes, uh, it's one of the reasons, obviously, I, I play Isaac on my channel. Just got me into it so much, but, like, one of my favourite things about his commentary was just that I just learned so much random shit. <laughs> like, so much random shit from him, it was just, he just had this endless stream of, of just weird, like, I can't believe that hit me. He just had this endless stream of oh my god. Let's let's not play like absolute crap, shall we? Yeah, he just had this endless stream of weird knowledge. Hey! That that right there is some fire rate. And we did get some mini Isaacs with guns larger than their own body, which I absolutely love. <laughs> um Right, let's keep this going. Ooh, that's actually kind of interesting, um, because we do have the ability to get on here item effects out of those chests now because of, uh, my mod. So, they're not as bad as they would seem. Ooh, that was a nice chest as well. Lovely. I can definitely tell the fire rate has increased here. That's nice. Lovely. Oh, God. <laughs> the mini Isaacs are just great. Oh my god, I knew there was going to be enemies spawning in here. Didn't quite realise one was going to spawn on me. My bad. Okay, let's be a little careful here. Oh, the whirling leeches from when you get hit have, like, such insane speed on this floor because of the water. It's beautiful. Also, any leeches that enemies spawn become ours, so it's pretty good stuff, whirling leech. Considering it gives you a HP up as well. Lovely. Oh, crab, no. I didn't manage to get the crab either. Oh, no. Oh, I don't know what happened there, but I'm happy about it. I think a fire mine shot opened that up, maybe? Thank you. Ooh, lovely. A little filled burn heart there. Don't mind if I do. Ah, just a bit of more angel chance is all. Nothing crazy. Okay.
Okay, good. And then in here, we've got a welding sack. It's obviously not going to be insane, but it's extra bombs. A welding sack does increase your bomb radius by quite a bit as well, so it's pretty good. Okay, easy stuff. I think we're pretty much straight onto our boss here. If we have any red hearts available, we can do those mimic chests without um, losing too much, to be honest, because we've got a burn heart now. With all the little shells all over the floor, the little bullets. Okay, nice and easy on that one. Easy stuff. I'm really liking this character. It's just, it's just like I said as well. It just, it just feels quite vanilla, and which is weird for a character that has a gun. I mean, lots of people have done uh, gimmicky Isaac gun sort of mods. That's like something that's been around for a while. Um, it's like Isaac has a gun mod, all that sort of stuff. Uh, but they're, they're always like they give him like a realistic looking gun that's like super overpowered. No one's ever sort of done anything like this, I don't think. Or at least if it's been done, it's not been done well. This has been done well. Good old humbling bundle. Lovely. There's our uh, welting sack doing some good work. Easy stuff. And we get... Tear size down is going to be kind of interesting, but the tears up is good. Oh, look! Absolutely tiny, tiny, tiny tears. Also, I really like the way that like visual effects work in this character. Like, we can see that we've got this lemon head effect, but it's still underneath our hat, and I, I think that looks really cool. I can't tell if our fire rate affects how quick we fire with quick draw. I think it does affect it, you know. Also, it might even it might even affect our reload speed, to be honest. Maybe, oh, maybe it mainly affects our reload speed. This is kind of hard to tell. Because our reload seems a lot faster. Lovely. Ah, oh, I should have bombed that. I'm stupid. My bad. I just saw the poop and I was like, yeah, destroy the poop. It's like, no, the whole reason that was there is so you could bomb it, you fool. Well, you two are annoying, aren't you? I like the way you just sit over the top of rocks. Get out of here. Okay, Let's be careful. Oh my god, the fire. It's okay, though. It's okay. We got a uh, burn heart for a reason. Allows to keep it filled, keep it going. Lovely stuff. Go, my leechy boys. What we got in here, then? Reflux. Tears start boiling shortly after firing. Mm, kind of interesting. Let's give this a go. Kind of interesting. I mean, with our current shot speed, it's not amazing. But we do have pretty good fire rate, so it kind of works out. Um, I might have messed up taking this item, to be honest. It's pretty hard to get the explosion to work. Yeah, it's it's almost impossible. Oh, dude, what the fuck is this room? Excuse me? Fuck. With this fire rate, I literally... Okay. I'm just gonna um, remove reflux real quick. I'm sorry. I know that's cheaty, but... The character clearly doesn't work with that item involved, and I already lost a lot of HP, so... <laughs> I feel like that's my punishment enough. I just wanted to try new things, but yeah, because of the shot speed, I physically, like, can't get my shot to explode on enemies, which basically just means all I've done is taken an absolutely massive tears down, which is just not fun. 
I try, I try new things, but I'm gonna admit to myself when things don't work. I should have thought about that before I took it, but I was like, ooh, potential interesting synergy. But I, I forget that reflux is based on like time traveled, not distance traveled. With it being time traveled, when you've got a shot that travels that fast, it just, yeah. How are you not dead yet? Okay, good. And we got ourselves one of these bad boys. Ooh, ability to smell a trinket. If only we had one. <laughs> if only we had one. Anyways. Not terrible. Right, we got a moon card for the next floor. Let's keep moving on. See what we can find. And take out our boss. We've got this whirling sack as well, so the boss should be pretty easy. I'm going to pretty much exclusively use my bombs for bosses. Brother Bobby or Nuna, thank you. I always forget about these bloody sack people. Alright, I did think that this is maybe secret room here, so I'm just going to check it out. Ayo, it is. Lovely. Um, oh, that's pretty good. We'll, um... Use that in here, I guess. Lovely. That was quite a lot of money there. Um, shall I hop to our shop real quick? We've got we've got high high enough speed to make it like reasonably speedy. Let's go for it. Uh, Burger Bombs. It's kind of kind of an interesting one to go along with their uh, Humbling Bundle, but <laughs> still. It kind of just guarantees they're doubled now, I guess. It could, it'd be cool if it could then drop Quad Bombs. Oh, for f of course I didn't mean to use that. God damn it, I meant to use my Quick Draw. Oops. Bit of a waste of my Moon card there. It is what it is. Oh my god, there was one of those dudes in this room. Didn't see ya. Ooh, full soul heart out of that poop though. Makes me feel a lot better. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do at all. Okay. Oh, dude, open your goddamn mouth, you big her. I just wanted to try to throw a bomb in there. There you go. Alright, Angel Deal, please save us. No Angel Deal. On a 67% chance, that just feels... I know that 67 isn't 100, but couldn't it just be? God damn it. This character is deceivingly difficult. <laughs> also, I'm playing deceivingly bad. That, that, that's, that's another big part of it, is that I'm just playing real bad as of late. I want my burn heart back. Yeah, no, not not dealing with that. <laughs> can't, I can barely hit you.
Do you know what? Also not dealing with this. Some of these rooms are real difficult. We got Chaos of Creation as well, so we might get some tinted rocks being reanimated on occasion. I think it, I think that the difficulty with this character is there's always like downtime while you're waiting for your bullets to charge up. How did that hit me? God damn it! I'm playing so poorly right now. It's it's frustrating. All right, let's continue on. Yeah, I guess I'm playing really bad at the minute. It's <laughs> it's a bit embarrassing, but I don't know. I think it's just because I'm not in the Isaac mindset as of late. We'll try to do our best. Oh, Grabber, really? Grabber's really not the sort of guy we should be taking, but he's here. He can be a little bit of a nuisance, can Grabber. I need to get Soul Heart, so. Sadly, no such, no such thing for us. Ah, oh, bugger. Good, good. Right, boss time. Oh, I... I bloody bashed him straight into me and lost my angel chance. What on earth is this ghost doing? My god. Oh, I can't believe I lost that angel deal. One second. Had a very big sneeze there, apologies. Yeah, that was that was embarrassing. Anyways, next floor. Ugh. Not feeling too enthusiastic about the way that I'm playing right now. It seems to be very much a repeat of the uh, the showcase episode. Thank you, Grabber, for uh, repositioning this fella for me. I just feel like I've got, like, really bad damage. Like, obviously, um, what's it called is helping. Uh, not $3 bill. Play-Doh Cookie is helping. But my damage is just pathetic. <laughs> like, w when I'm not using Quick Draw, that is. Quick Draw, obviously, is great, but I don't get to use that all the time. Can you stop standing in places that make it really hard to hit you, please? That definitely makes me feel a bit better. 30% chance um, on entering a room to activate pause. That's actually pretty good. Pocket traffic light. I we'll have to slightly position ourselves for the room. Ooh, chance for upgrading stuff though. That's probably more valuable. If we had an orbital, I'd definitely take the pause. <coughs> Grabber, can you not be such a nuisance? Cool. Hey, look at that. Golden bomb. I'll be using a hell of a lot of golden bombs on this floor. guy. That's a floor restart. It's probably pretty useful for us. Let's find a fool card so we can uh, try and get an angel deal then redo. Hey, upgraded there, look. Gotta love that. Nice. Yeah, this is going to be pretty useful. Ow. Oh, I lost the full soul heart there. That was idiotic. Oh my god, I lost my angel deal again. 
I didn't realize these enemies shot when they landed, even though that's literally what just hit me in the last room. Oh my god. Just kill me now. Please. End me. This is embarrassing. When I said kill me now, I wasn't mean literal. Fuck's sake. Oh my days. <laughs> I really do apologize, people. Sometimes there's just days where Isaac just doesn't gel. Doesn't. Normally it's like I get I get really good at Isaac again when I sort of play it for a few days, but I've literally been having days off. Are you kidding me? Shard of glass? Fuck it, let's just take it. Can't get any worse, can it? Grabber, you need to chill. Cool. That's not a secret room. Oh, there's fucking flies there. I've started bleeding. Great. The bleeding has begun. Why the hell is that fool card? Also, why you gotta be like this? Why you gotta create these guys? There it is. That's a lot of keys, goddamn. Fifty eight bombs now, that's pretty good. I like that. <clears throat> Ah, I've killed myself. Well, this was, um, pathetic. I hope you guys enjoyed. <laughs> I really need to just... It's, it, like I said, it's because I'm not playing a lot of Isaac right now. Um, it, it is what it is. I hope you guys did enjoy regardless. We'll try and jump back on this character on occasion and not play so pathetically. Maybe next episode I'll just play as a character that I know I can get a win as, like Samuel or something like that. Either way, I hope you guys did enjoy. I'll see you guys in the next one.